One day he put his name on a label and that's how he started. It was at my mother's kitchen. My mother used to do the sandal bags. And Badia Spices was born. The Spice King, Pepe Badia, took over the family business from his father, filling spice bottles with construction paper funnels and selling them at the beach. Now, Badia Spices produces about 700 items. Spices are universal. You know, garlic is garlic, whether you're Oriental or Anglo or Hispanic. And it's all made in South Florida. And it's made here, so we, we blend it, we pack it. The company has grown to 170 employees, and its new 65,000-square-foot production facility in Doral is state-of-the-art. That's my obsession, because I used to fill with a funnel. I'm obsessed with efficiency and production. In 1989, the company exploded when Publix added the Badia line to its stores. Now, their spices are sold worldwide, from Dallas, Texas, to the Caribbean, and even Nigeria. If you had told me that 15 years ago, I said, come on, come on, man, <laughs> don't do that. That's not funny. Well, it is, it's happening. So what's the secret behind Badia's success? You know, we have a moderately priced product. We're simple. We get on the shelf with our ethnic sort of twist, but then, you know, we hope to be for everybody. The company plans to increase production and start packaging teas in South Florida, which means they will be hiring in the near future. We should continue to grow, God willing, in the next 10 years or so. That's the beauty of America. America is unbelievable. Love to hear about jobs. And Badia is especially proud of the company's charitable contributions. It's launching a special edition garlic soon with the Breast Cancer Awareness logo. And for each bottle sold, Badia will donate a portion to charity. So keep your eyes out for a great cause.